This is Twit. Russell, I have your app installed. Tell us a little bit about it. I think we I think we talked about this a little bit on the on the show last year, but it's never been in the arena. So tell us what you like about it. Yeah, so this is an app called Grasshopper. It comes from a Google sort of experimental area. I think it's called Area 120 or something like that. It's um, they have a group of people kind of developing, you know, new and interesting, um, you know, proof of concepts and sort of example apps and you know, cool ways to do things. And this is one where I guess it's trying to teach you to code, right? And uh, I'm like one of those people, you know, like if you've ever met someone who's vegetarian or vegan or is into some, you know, really unique thing, they'll do nothing but tell you about it. And I'm a developer, so I'm going to do nothing but tell you about, you know, you should learn to code. Um, So they give you really, it starts off really simple, right? Um, They give you a really simple set of commands where you can be like, oh, I want to draw a box and I want to make the box blue. And it looks like you've already been through this, but if you do the French flag one, Jason, that one's kind of like a really simple example if you just go next on that screen. Um, it basically tells you, hey, you're going to use the little grasshopper to try and draw a French flag, um, which is, you know, two rows of blue, two rows of white, and two rows, rows of red. And it's kind of done the first line for you. And it's like, okay, so if you tap in that um, in the box there, it's like, here's all the tools, you know, you have. You can draw a box and you can choose the color that you want to draw the box. And you're basically just trying to recreate the pattern above. And I guess this is a real sort of simple way to introduce people to programming because whenever I tell people, you know, I'm a developer, they're like, oh, you must be really smart. You must be really good at maths. But the truth of programming is you don't have to be smart. You don't even have to know maths. Like it's it's just basically learning like ways to structure things to, you know, use them over and over again to build more and more complex things. And this app does a fairly good um, sort of job of walking you through those. So, yeah, if you've ever had someone in your life, you know, young or old, who's been interested in learning programming uh, and they've got an Android phone, this is Free, you can install it and you know they can sort of walk through the various examples and they get more and more complicated obviously as you go so they try and teach you um you know bigger and bigger concepts in in the programming world how many blue boxes will be created with this code draw boxes bob r r r i'm guessing three oh that's a good question I uh, no that would be four <laughs> four Boxes, Not quite. <laughs> of course, I am just guessing. <laughs> I don't actually know. Uh, how many blue boxes? Okay, now I just want to know. Two? Two? Every <laughs> letter inside of the parentheses of the draw boxes function creates a box. For example, draw boxes Bob will create a blue box, then an orange box, then another blue box. You'll get it next time. So then the answer was what? Was three? Because there's three letters. Bob, so I feel like I got that right. Am I not right? I feel like you got that right as well. What's going on here? Oh, how many blue boxes? I don't know. Well, Bob is three letters. Mm-hmm. So there's six total. But, then, but that was oh, one no, of the three. It's not an option. <laughs> not an option. Wait, Here, really? let's see. I'm, I'm, <laughs> gonna, it's programming is really I'm just going to... Uh, so it's two. Okay. <laughs> Since there are two of the oh, letter B inside the... How many blue boxes? The, there you go. Yeah. Oh, yeah, okay. We didn't read the question. So this is a classic university thing. you got to read the question. Oh, okay. And the prince, two blue boxes. Whatever. I'm not a coder. The rest of the app isn't as bad as that. There are some really cool things you can do in here. (laughs) It's really cool. No, and I love love the the approach of it, and it it really does make a lot of sense. And, you know, there's a little bit of incentive around uh, unlocking achievements and everything. Great place to start. Um, excellent. And I love your quote. You don't have to be smart, smart to be a coder. Yeah. Just, uh, just point yourself at that. If anyone thinks they need to be smart or no maths or whatever, just say, I know this Russell guy, he's an idiot and he knows no maths and <laughs> he can program sort of. So, so can you. It's kind of like a puzzle. Like you're, you're like coding is kind of like a puzzle, right? Mm-hmm. Just putting it all together. Yeah, definitely. Uh, very cool stuff. Grasshopper, learn to code for free.